today we're going to be putting two of the biggest retail sneaker stores up to battle for a thousand dollar mystery box. We have no idea what's inside, so let's head to the mall. This should be fun. Hey, I have an odd request. I want to spend a thousand bucks, but I want you to pick it all and I'll just pay for it and not see what it is. Okay. Are you down to do that? I'm down. I'm so down. Oh, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I always forget how long it takes to do this because they have to like go out pricing and stuff. But first one secured, now we gotta go get JD Sports. Yeah, so I was talking to the old manager Abby here. Um, see if you guys would be down to put together like a thousand dollars of the shoes for me. When I entered the JD Sports store, I immediately was asked not to film inside of the store, and I talked to the manager and wanted to see if they could still put together a $1,000 mystery box for me, and they gave me the okay. Even though I wasn't allowed to film, the store employees were super excited to go ahead, put this box together, so I was able to get one super quick and get out of the store. All right, we just got our stuff from JD, just putting them in. We're gonna go back to the warehouse, unbox it, see who won out of the two stores. This should be fun. Foot Locker versus JD Sports. The battle is now begun. Retail stores, who made the better mystery box for $1,000? Let's dive into it. I'm gonna fire through these pretty quick because we have a ton of shoes to get through, but let's first go for Foot Locker. $1,000 and they did everything in my size. And the first thing that we see is New Balances. This is a New Balance 2002R. Ooh, this is really clean actually. New Balances are really in this summer and uh, you can get a lot of different pairs at Foot Locker. And so this is a good pair right here. I actually like that colorway. This is a really easily styled colorway in my size second pair new balance this is a new balance 550 oh this is a great one the gray the white easy to wear 550 amazing summer shoot low socks high socks and they have a lot of good colorways in these now especially in orange colorway so when they were asking what i like i was like i like jordan's type stuff and they wanted to make sure they cured it in my size i don't know if jd did my size so we'll have to see all right next we have a Jordan 1 Mid Craft, size 11. These are pretty cool. I feel like I've seen a different colorway of these, but they don't even look like a mid, really. They look like a high, but that's pretty, oh, whoa, it's on the outside. That's weird. A lot of cool materials on here, giving the vibes of like the Zion Williamson uh, Jordan 1 Lowe's, but cool vibes of Craft right there. Retail on the Jordan 1s is higher now, and so that's what's making them sit in stores, but that's a good one right there. It's a little different. This is a Jordan 1 Low. This is like a, ooh, this is like a, bread variant. It's like a bread, but with a white swoosh. Nice little color there. These are all shoes you guys can go to the mall and buy. That's what's cool about these types of videos. As we move on, we got an Air Force One. Ooh, this is an Air Force One. This is a cool design. It's kind of like a canvas material in blue. This is like a nice quality Air Force One, actually. This is, I haven't even seen these. It's an interesting one. So we got two New Balances, Jordan 1 High, or Jordan 1 Mid, Jordan 1 Low, and an Air Force. And then we still have four left. What are these? Spider-Man Crocs? Marvel Spider-Man Crocs. I have no clue what these look like. Let's see. Dang, we got the Croc Boys. Look at that. You got the Spider-Man gibbets on there. There's another Spider-Man box there. I kind of peeked it when I was uh, pulling these out. But Spider-Man Crocs, that's an interesting one. Nice little summer cushion shoe. Then we got another Croc. And let's see. If, I wonder if this is the same one. Probably not. This is a different one. <laughs> these are hilarious. These are like kids croc, but full size. Look at that, Marvel right there. Got the Spider-Man on the toe. And they glow in the dark, just like Nick's mummies that he wears. This is gonna be another New Balance 2002R, and this color is black, super clean. Black 2002R, again, New Balances are hot right now. Everybody's loving them, and you can get them at the mall. We got one more New Balance, and we'll show you guys a shot of everything in the Foot Locker one, and then we'll compare it to the one in the JD Sports. Here we go, New Balance 2002R in the gray colorway. We got all the colors. This is actually a really good one too. Super clean, a lot of solid options for shoes here. Nothing insane, but a lot of solid options. Shout out Foot Locker for doing that. I know this is fun for them. And I'm waiting for one of them to say, please don't return this stuff. And guys, we're not returning any of this stuff. We usually do like giveaways and all this stuff or we'll sell it to you guys for super cheap. So look out for something on that maybe soon. I think it's pretty good that you got nine shoes for Nine shoes for a thousand bucks. All right, guys, gotta hop in here and give a huge shout out to the sponsor of today's video and long-term sponsor of this channel, Scentbird. Scentbird reimagines the way that you go about buying, discovering, shop for, and experience colognes and perfumes. Colognes are a way for you to express yourself in your everyday life. Now, Semper provides a new designer fragrance every single month for just $17. So instead of having to commit to an entire bottle of cologne that could be hundreds of dollars, you can go ahead and try it out for 30 days and keep freshening up your scent every single month 
month with different things if you want different things for summer, things for winter, things for fall. And each month when you get your package in, you get a card with your package that lets you know the different hits of your cologne that you got this month. This one has salted lime, driftwood, lavender, all different kinds of flavors so you can see what kind of scent you're going to be putting out. So here is the scent bird bottle right here as you can see which is perfect for travel. This gives you a 30 day supply of a different cologne or perfume. Inside you have the tube that shows you the name of the cologne or perfume. And like I said, this is perfect for travel. You can slip it in your luggage. You can take it with you when you travel on vacation. You don't have to worry about the big bottle where you can't actually take that with you. They carry tons of designer brands like Prada, Gucci, Versace, anything you can think of. And you can also upgrade your subscription to more than one a month. I actually do three a month. If you guys use the code Neville, you can get 55% off of Semper. That's just over $7 for your first month. So go ahead and check out Semper down below. Use code Neville. 55% off your first order. And thank you to Semper for sponsoring this video. We went to JD Sports, which I'm seeing a lot of dunks. JD, we have one, two, three, four, seven shoes. Let's see, we got a Dunk Low Panda Baby and a good size, size 10. It is so crazy you can just get these at a store now. A Dunk Low Panda, they're 100 bucks. They used to be 400, it's crazy. But glad everybody can get them now. That's a decent size. So looks like they probably aren't doing my size because they got an eight, nine and a half, which could be different for each store. Like, but I think that they picked exactly what they wanted to pick for uh, Foot Locker. And we have a women's Jordan three, size five and a half. Ooh, the, this is the Lucky Greens. Yeah, this is the Lucky Greens size four Y, five and a half. Pretty solid pair right there. Obviously a smaller size, but I like these. These are clean. Retail on these was higher, so I feel like some of the bigger sizes were sitting at stores. I told Foot Locker that I'm like into kind of Jordans and stuff like that, so they got a couple of them in there, but I didn't even say that to them. So another Dunk Low in, ooh, it's like a reverse panda. Check that out. All white with the black. Another one that is size nine. Pretty cool that you can get this at the mall. That's all I'm saying. If you ever wanted dunks, now is the time to go get them for retail or even under retail. They had some dunk highs for on sale there. Looks like we got another Dunk Low in a 7Y. This is going to be, ooh, that's interesting. It's like a panda, but with a blue on the back. Dark Marina Blue Panda, it's a good one. Size seven Y, use seven. So we got three dunks, Jordan three. Is this another Jordan three? Jordan five, size eight. Ooh, a purple Jordan five low. That's interesting. That's a weird one. It's an interesting colorway. I didn't even know these came out. Jordan 5 lows, I feel like don't always like do that well. I feel like it's pretty unique because a lot of people like the highs, but uh, that's why it's a women's sizing right there. And we got two left. We're firing through these. We got a Nike Dunk Low Retro S. I paid resale for these freaking shoes at Got Soul. This is the Gone Fishing Nike SBs. I got these from one of my buddies who's on the Ravens. He's a big fisher. And I decided to get him this and the, the like lighter pair. But these are sitting. You can see kind of like fish gills there on the tongue. It has the like fishing on there, the fish on there. And they have two pairs of these. And these are sitting at the malls, which is crazy. And then lastly, we have a Jordan 5. Well, here's the total. After tax and everything, $1,070. So here we go. Jordan 5. Oh, these are the safety orange. This is really clean. I think I like a vintage looking outsole would look pretty cool on this, but the colorway itself is solid. You have like a cream, you have orange. Of course, I love orange, my favorite color, but uh, that's good. I don't know, I feel like JD might take the dub on this. What do you think, Nick? I kind of feel the same way. I feel the same way. Let's put them up. Let's put a, let's give you a shot of these. Then we're gonna put them side by side and see what you guys think. Here we have both of the options from Foot Locker and JD Sport. What do you guys think about the different pairs that we got from each store? Which do you think was the better mystery box? Let me know in the comments down below. I really wanna hear what you guys think. For me, if I'm looking at it, I am liking the one with a little more dunks, a little bit more of the newer hype stuff, but I wanna see what you guys think in the comments down below. Hopping in here for a brand new giveaway of a pair of Nike SP Orange Lobsters. The rules for this giveaway are very simple. Just one, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Number two, follow me at Harris Neville on Instagram. Number three, go and leave a comment on this picture up on the screen of me holding these that is over on my Instagram and tag two friends and we'll pick the winner in three weeks time. And that is it. Orange color is awesome, especially next to this GT4S. Go ahead and check out the giveaway now.